today. Hmm. Oh, Baba Jesus. <laughs> I didn't know that what was coming for me was beyond me. Man. Oh, my God. I'm so sure. Please. about 10 minutes to 5 I hope you can see me <laughs> and um, I'm heading to work <sighs> so um, I went from my pound this morning I ate small because I need that strength <laughs> I need all the strength I can get for that standing of 8 hours but I just yeah. thought to check in with you and um yeah <laughs> oh god it was a struggle waking up this morning man a huge struggle like uh i have to hasten up because my boss will be here in a couple of minutes um it's part of the things we go through so be ready if we're coming to canada be ready i mean just in case your journey is like mine <laughs> but other than that you're good you're fine but either ways i mean i've never had to wake up this early i woke up for 30 in fact never sleep i said let me sleep small that was when i had alarm <laughs> after prayers <laughs> i just had alarm for 30 i had to get up <laughs> so um waking up this early to go to work i can't even wait to have a proper job when i go to work like in day like normal daylight <laughs> and not be and not be rushing by 4 30 just because i want to meet up with the boss ah it's a struggle man <laughs> it's a struggle and then you come back all you want to do is sleep you're standing eight hours man like in fact sometimes i sleep during the break because i'm just too tired and I have assignments spending my group people. <laughs> they are waiting for me. Kai man, it is it is well. God help us. Ah. Uh, well, I'll see you guys. Okay, so um, I just got off my bus. <laughs> um, I thought to say something here. <laughs> so this particular job, right? I take a bus from my house and I take two buses actually. So the, the second one, the first one, you know, drops me and then I pick the, then I enter the second one. The second one, yeah, <laughs> where it's heading to, 
for some reason i don't know i don't quite understand it all yet but for some reason um i don't know maybe it's outskirt like it's outside of some sort like you shall pay extra fare for like when you cross a particular place so how do i discourage this you pay extra fare like once you cross a particular stop basically that's it <laughs> as a student where i've been now <laughs> and cutting my coats clothes size everything all this at the job whatever i'm always saying that i don't even know <laughs> I like to drop at where the fair before the fair starts like that extra fair before it starts I like to drop so that <laughs> so what I do is I walk with leg direct because I think it's like four dollars or something how much are they paying minimum wage and then I will now be spending four dollars go combo like to and fro that's eight dollars <laughs> so this is the early morning exercise so you guys see part of the reason why i'm skinny i do exercise <laughs> i need to hit the gym and go and start squatting or something because i don't even know all those back and chelsea need to come out <laughs> oh my god you guys should just just ignore me and my back and chelsea so yeah um that's what I do and it's a walk of like 20 minutes depending on your pace but the good thing is the work starts by 6 30 a.m and um this is still like six o'clock no this is like 5 30 or to six I don't know but it's not at six so I walk 20 minutes and I still get there calm down relax before my shift starts my hand is shaking so yeah those are one of the things like this one i never knew about it until i started this i didn't know that it was possible to be you know going to a job where you still have to pay extra fare apparently it's outside or it's i don't know it's far from where i stay or whatever maybe it's outside the usual ttc area that's the bus so we gotta pay <laughs> um yeah so i'm walking down 20 minutes do my exercise pray while i'm at it or you know something meditate shall do something shy like honestly i really don't mind because it's even a good time for me to ponder on you know certain things maybe even get ideas on what to film or you know inspiration shall comes <laughs> so yeah we don't complain we give god thanks uh yeah <laughs> you guys should <laughs> just ignore my weaver bag <laughs> ladies especially mind yourself <laughs> just ignore my weed because guys might not even really know. some guys might know sha but the hair has gone back to factory setting so just ignore it <laughs> And I don't have strength. I don't have strength or time to even be getting another one. So let's just be managing. <laughs> we should be managing it for now. Um, plus, it's my hustle hair. So even if I, I was, you know, I had a good one, another one, bone straight, <laughs> straight bone or whatever, um, I probably wouldn't be wearing it to, you know, this job. So it's, it's hustle, you know? Let you understand there are some hustle outfits it's just like when you're going to the market now you cannot be wearing your best dress like typical correct market you want to go and get food store for groceries or niger now not um not this type of groceries <laughs> but i don't know how to put it but yeah so that's it it's my hustle hair and my hustle shoe now what's your wear? <laughs> so you guys should just ignore me I'm feeling sleepy. Um, what was I saying? Um, who 
sent me to go and eat this from the office early morning. <laughs> ah, she be I, I'm supposed to take you for lunch. Talora Michelle. Ah, this one will be sleeping on duty. Guys, I'm so heavy. <laughs> I feel heavy. I just ate small, just small pandu yam just to feel because I was rushing like let me just eat something to hold belly till 12 when I get lunch. <laughs> no, I'm feeling sleepy, I'm feeling heavy, I'm feeling and you know pandu yam now, it's like pounded yam. <laughs> oh God, no, help me today. Today, I will probably sleep during lunch. There's no, I don't even know. But oh well, we move. Hi guys so i just finished my shift for the day <laughs> um today's working you call it water look how rough i am this is not how i live well i don't even know the hair sha the hair don't go back to factory setting <laughs> and i can't even be bothered what my back like my spine i literally have to sit down to just rest small Ah, God, 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 God. <laughs> ah, that moment when five minutes nap is like five hours because you just need that sleep. 
I was sleep deprived. I literally didn't sleep all night. So that that small nap, it just felt like that was the sleep I needed for the night. I'm so tired, and all I can think of. Anyone who's worked in a factory before, like you can literally relate. All you can think of is sleep, not even food. If they give me food at this point, I can't wait to sleep. Like I choose um, sleep over food. Any as in at this moment though, after work like this. Ah no 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 no. <laughs> Oh god and so this um season right like is is an important one in my church it's called mr of the year season so <laughs> ordinarily i would like engage yesterday where they posted me because it's like in fact you know so they do job rotation you go here today they post you online the other tomorrow you're in another so you don't really know where you'd be tomorrow you know the next day so yesterday i was all i did was to tape um um the what's it called now box you, you know like noodles box or juice box like the box the, you tape the bottom just very simple something that was all i did for like my shift eight hours shift after today when i first got here i was like ah thank this man oh god thank you for this man oh god bless this man that he posted me hey i'm looking at myself sorry god thank you for this man oh that he posted me to a good place we we're just putting um paper on the sachet and all of that i didn't know what was coming <laughs> i didn't know that what was coming for me was beyond me man my back my spine i was now bending i was standing I will bend though. I will stand though. The woman, the people will be looking, are you okay? Are you okay? I say yes. <laughs> then what time like that? The woman was like, don't worry, we have five minutes more to go for a break. For when it was like about time for the lunch break. Ah oh, God. So ordinarily I yesterday I was even happy. I was dancing like I was literally dancing. You could you could feel my happy face underneath the face mask. I was singing, I was dancing. Today, hmm, Obara Jesus. <laughs> I couldn't do nada. See, now I understand that scripture that says that if anybody is sick, call on the elders. Because you can't pray for yourself. Oh. If you have pain, if you're sick, you cannot do anything. So you don't need to call people to pray for you. Because you cannot even pray. You, it's prayer from the heart that you'll be praying. You'll be praying, God have mercy. Don't let me die. <laughs> With your heart, not with your mouth, though. That was my situation today. Like, I was in pain. I was in severe pain. Ah, my back was hurting like you look day. Who did I offend? <laughs> Small prayer that I'll be, I'll just be speaking in tongues. I'll just be like, God, God. Well, the one time that I know that, one time that the pain hooked me, like, the, my spine, it just felt like something happened with my spine, like, the pain on my back. I was like, God, please, I need a change of job. <laughs> like, that was the thing that literally came out of my mouth. Like, I couldn't even think of kingdom advancement prayers, nada. As in the thing that came out of my mouth, was, God, please change this job. I was too... And that pain was mad. I was like, God, please change this job for me. My hand, though, my back, oh, my leg, go. Oh, everything was just aching. I couldn't just wait. When it was time for breakfast, like this, as in, we usually get, so, an eight-hour shift, you probably get one-hour break, like, 15 minutes first for breakfast. Um, 30 minutes for lunch, that's by 12. Um, from that, maybe breakfast, we get, like, break by... 8 15 or 9 uh 8 30 between 8 and 9 o'clock depending on the line you are working on so like after that one before 12 will now knock before 12 o'clock you'll be looking you'll be wondering how many hours are we used in this shift why isn't it 12 o'clock yet like very annoying something you know when you just look you look at time now 12 uh, let's say 11 uh, let's say 9 then you walk, 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 walk. You think our uh, time has gone. You look, oh, 905. What is all this? <laughs> 905, just five minutes. Oh, God, God, God. Eh, oh, man. I couldn't wait. I was like, God, they should not put me on this line tomorrow. God forbid. They should put me where I was yesterday. If 
even the woman that was heading our line the woman said was like she, she doesn't want this place tomorrow like ah everyone was tired like what is this the standing like i mean the old job like the old factory said everybody stands there's no sitting like that but this particular one was just not it like ah ah no 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 i don't pray this thing for this kind of job for my enemy what <laughs> ah see if you are if you are back home and you have relatives here eh except they tell you what they're doing like they use their mouth to tell that if they are not even lying but ordinarily maybe you're like you, you know there are some of some people that will be like i've not heard from because me <laughs> i've only spoken to my family members maybe once this week because all i want to do now is past 3 p.m all i want to do is sleep before i wake up i don't know <laughs> and i still have assignments like they are piling i have one due tomorrow i think i have to do next week as in all of that stuff like in my head so i don't even have time for myself let alone for someone so if you have time that you'll be getting angry my brother did not come my auntie did not come my sister did not come my dear calm down <laughs> your auntie is going through things it be things in this canada it be things <laughs> even some people that are bosses that you think okay they have cars people have cars here now that you think they are managers they are kinikon they probably have a second job or even without one job safe they they work their head off for the money that they are earning so i don't know i just want to let that out there but uh, all the same sha thank god <laughs> i don't know it seems like i was ranting then now i'm off but you guys know i just felt to you know let you in on what's going on <laughs> so uh today during break i heard one good news from one of my friends so she called me that she got a job oh god i was elated i was elated like i was so happy for her and i was like ah congratulations blah 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 and i could just you know after the call to be honest here yeah, i was like the devil was about trying to set in with you know how you be like eh, you now want to be thinking hey god when is it my turn blah 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 and from that small thought you now before you know it you don't enter jealousy oh my, i just snapped out of it like what i just remember this popular thing that you know that it's always being said that um when god blesses your neighbors your friend or some uh, your friend or someone shall around you that means it's in your neighborhood so i was like hey god is in my neighborhood because two of my friends like they've gotten a job like a better job you know not the job job i mean but it's better than this factory thing that we are standing now many hours and all the jobs that we've been doing that is standing standing so i was like hey god is in my neighborhood oh it will soon be my turn oh i was so happy when i entered i was working that was like the moment when I, I i could say that you know my spirit was lifted a bit like i was happy i was just joyous in me like hey god thank you thank you thank you okay so after that now i just enjoyed the rest of my uh, my shift I, I i really couldn't pray to be honest like i i don't even feel too good <laughs> some so i feel like ah i'm not praying i'm not praying i'll just maybe speak in tongues for a while then i'll be as in the pain like the the your whole the whole of your body or your attention is literally on that pain so it just feels like you can't even do anything like i'm like god ah god i can't i can't deal please i need a change of job like i can't deal ah i need a change of job let me come and be going <laughs> thank you guys so so much thank you thank you guys i prayed for you people though in the small while i was on and off my prayers i like, got my subscribers bless them bless them bless them heal the sick the dead i was just talking in the it's not in the nonsense yeah, but i was just you know all over the place <laughs> kind of prayer like you know give the barren children the singles marriage the jobless jo as in that when you stress the jobless job you know when you're in a particular situation it's easier to pray for people in like how do i put when they raise prayer points in church like pray for the sick pray for this if you are not experiencing it you might not be so you know your your prayer will not be as hard as someone 
who is in that situation. So when I God, when my prayer just reach jobless, I was like, hey God, oh the jobless job, <laughs> give the jobless job, give the unemployed um, job, blah blah blah. I stressed out that prayer because of course I know that in praying for others, my own too will come. So yeah, thank you guys so so much. I really really love you and I appreciate all of you. Thank you. God bless you and um, please don't forget to subscribe like share leave a comment below um follow me on instagram you know let's connect mm, what else all of that good stuff you know and i'll see you in my next one bye bye